20 years ago, when the first charter school opened, a reform movement was launched that unlocked choice in education. Now over 5,600 public charter schools nationwide are educating nearly 2 million students. We take on this mission not because it is easy, but because it is needed. With many students entering charter schools achieving below grade level, charter school educators must devise innovative methods to turn around the students' prior performance. The students enrolling at Imagine School at Camelback in Phoenix, Arizona often struggle with academics, discipline, and even basic life challenges such as nutrition. In serving this high minority and high free and reduced lunch population, Imagine staff recognized that prior efforts to teach and reach these students were not working. What I would see when I walk here at Imagine Carol back three years back is I would see students that were not engaged, students that were disruptive, um, arson that was taking place where they, I mean, our, our bathrooms were being lit on fire, you know, consistently. Um, a sense of hopelessness with our children, with our families, that, um, that for, for whatever reason, you know, society had given up on them. The atmosphere here two years ago was really negative and discouraging. There wasn't really much time for learning. And now the students here are really focused and are paying attention in their classes. And teachers help the students who aren't, and they talk to them. To the students. Imagine leaders began implementing best practices to reorganize the school leadership, bring on a new dynamic teaching staff, individualize education for every student, create a school culture of high expectations, and use data like data had never been used before. What I see now when I walk into the, the halls and classrooms of Magic Camelback, I see children engage. I see um, students that are happy. I see teachers excited about teaching, collaborating with each other to, to share the best practices in the classroom. I see parents with hope that their kids can and will be successful. I see a school that was totally transformed from those that did not believe to those that do believe. Um, I see a school destined for greatness. With engaging professional development, Rooted in helping each child reach their full potential, everyone at Imagine Camelback began to believe that all students could grow to meet and exceed expectations. So I think any school can turn around if you have committed leaders and committed teachers. Um, the turnaround that took place on this campus was not easy. Last year, most teachers were arriving between 5 and 6 and staying um, until 6 or 7 o'clock at night. We worked very long hours. We put in a lot of time, but we were committed because we knew that our students could achieve. We also had leaders that were here with us until 7 or 8 o'clock at night. At Imagine Camelback, data is front and center every day, even to the point where students know their own data. Students lead parent-teacher conferences, explaining their data, showing how they have grown, their strengths, and areas where they need to focus and improve. The data wall demonstrates to staff daily how each child, each class, and the school as a whole is improving. Transparency is key to accountability, but equally important to knowing who to go to for advice. Using the data, the team strengthens as teachers seek out their colleagues whose students showed stronger results. So data becomes an integral part of the school. It's like the lifeline of the school. And you have to talk data every day. And you have to share data, um, and you have to be transparent with data, not only with teachers, but with students and parents as well. And you have to set goals, your action plan. How are you gonna accomplish these goals? How are you gonna move these kids academically? But most important, you need to believe that these kids can do it. You need to believe that they, go, they can go from 10% mastery to 72% mastery in reading, which has happened here at our school. This year, the state of Arizona recognized Imagine Camelback as a turnaround school. Partnerships with Kitchen on the Street, Teach for America, and many other community groups have been essential to meeting the students' daily academic and life needs. We can only compete for the best jobs the highest tech type jobs, uh, the higher wage jobs, 
if we have a education system that we can be proud of. Obviously, Imagine has done incredible work at their Camelback location, knowing that just a few years ago, uh, a small percentage of their students were doing uh, schoolwork at the appropriate level. Just a few years later, they've gotten up to 75%. It's an incredible comeback story, and it's an inspirational story, and it's a story that really is going to help make the future of our city. We owe it to our kids to have an outstanding education system, uh, a complete system, and I think Imagine Calumback is a big part of that. This turnaround is a testament to the hardworking Imagine leaders, staff, parents, students, community partners, and state officials who know that success can happen by working together. As part of the Imagine Schools network of 70 schools, Imagine Camelback is sharing its best practices with sister charter schools across Arizona and the nation. With higher expectations and practical tools to get there, dedicated Imagine educators in 12 states and D.C. are preparing 40,000 students for lives of leadership, accomplishment, and exemplary character. Parents are voting with their feet. They see the turnaround occurring and they want opportunity and choice. Competition is driving improvement in public education. Collaboration is making it happen. Imagine Schools joins the celebration of 20 years of public charter schools. Together as a charter school community, we are taking on the tough challenges to turn around public schools and give new options to parents seeking the right choice. Together with each local community, we are turning around lives, one student at a time.